one and about fell over. So tell me hello when you're popping on. I am going to work on a mason jar. And what I wanted to do was something that I did a few years ago before I was doing lives at all. And I forgot to, um, I didn't, I didn't give myself time. So we're just going to paint it up and make it cute. We're going to do some painting though. We are going to paint. And I know that that's not super fun to watch, but that's what we're going to do. So tell me hello when you're popping on. Hopefully some folks will come over here. If not, I'll just talk and replay won't be so boring. Um, making sure that I'm live. I'm making sure that it's set to um, public. You found me Lois. Good. I, I make this public every single time, but then when I get in here, it tells me I'm not public. So I, I don't, I don't know what is, what, I don't know what is happening. So I'm going to actually see if I can switch my account. Um, and see if I can make sure that I'm, make sure that it's public. Um, it won't let me. Don't know why it won't let me. Hello, Miss Lisa. Hang on, y'all. I'm probably, oh, here we go. Back. It won't let me. I don't know why it won't let me get one my YouTube here, but oh well, oh well. We'll just we're just gonna go with it. Some of y'all are finding me. Hey, Miss Fran. Hey, Mr. Scotty's mom. Hi, Denise. Well, I did, I did, but I don't think that it's working. I'm gonna see if I can share it again. It'll probably share to my regular page, but that's okay. I just can't figure all this out. Hey, Miss Betsy, I cannot figure all this YouTube stuff out. It's it's driving me crazy because I don't know. I made it where it's public, um, but I don't know how to keep it that way. You got it. You got the link. Okay, well, I'm going to put it in here one more time just to be sure. So, there. Now, now we can get started crafting because I know the people who are watching replay are like, please get on with it, lady. Please and thank you. So I got this from the Dollar Tree and I'm just going to pop this off. Don't know if I'll use it or not. And then um, I think, I don't know if I want to paint over this or what I'm going to do here. Hello, Miss Patty. Thank you for sprinkling. I sprinkled my page. I don't know. How well that's gonna go I mean I don't know I give up I was gonna go live in Facebook and do YouTube later tonight because I have my mentor group so I'll be on mentor group on Facebook later so I'll be on late on my youth on my Facebook page but then I decided nah I'm just gonna go ahead and do this I'm gonna keep it the same way I'm gonna be consistent for a while Mr. Scotty's mom, I'm actually Debbie Isaacs. I can't figure out how to change for my YouTube you're all right you're all right Debbie you can stay on your page it's okay. And this is kind of scuffy. Look, I mean, I don't know what happened to it. It's from the Dollar Tree that way. So I'm just going to go ahead and... I try to sometimes take these off because you can sometimes peel them off. But then other times, they're bad and they won't peel off. So, and then you get a nasty look and it's all bad. And, it's, and I don't want to do this side because I've got all my staples and all the holes over here. So I'm just going to paint over this and hope that it doesn't peel off. It's never peeled off before, but that doesn't mean that it won't in time. You know what I'm saying? Once it gets older and stuff, it might. That's okay. Because I just don't think that I can get it. And I don't have any goo gone. Oh, wait. I probably just done messed it up. I'm going to have to use the other side because I started peeling it off now. And that's sometimes you can get a good grip of it and you can just peel it right off but this one's not so now now we are going to have to pull this off and pull these staples out all the things 
You loved my lunch date. We had to go to Lowe's and get wood, so he's outside man in the machine today for me while I come in here and have fun in my craft room. And then I'm just gonna sand these down. And then I'll just put some brown paper over that and you'll never know it's torn on that side or some felt or something. We'll fix it up. We'll jazz it up. I went, I couldn't believe y'all how expensive painter's tape is. I about had a fit. I hadn't bought any in a while and I needed some. So I went to, when we were at Lowe's, I grabbed some painter's tape and wowers. That stuff is crazy expensive. So it's all right though. You gotta have it. You gotta have it. You like my glasses? Well, I have my contacts in. You know what I did? Which you're gonna hear the story twice if you watch me tonight. But um, I had these contacts in. I was going to put my right eye in. I already had my left eye in. And didn't feel like it was in there. When I closed my eye like this to look, couldn't see. So I thought, okay, well, I didn't get it in there. And um, so then I put another contact in. And I was like, okay, this feels weird. This feels really weird. I went outside to Mr. Terry. I, he was in the garage. And I had him, like, look over. And that other contact was stuck back here in the corner of my eye. It just didn't go on my eyeball, but it was in my eye. So, I had two contacts in today for, for a moment. I'd never done that before. That's a new one. Probably not the last, first time. Well, it was the first time, but it probably won't be the last. If I have to, if I know myself, it won't be the last time I do something silly like that. Have you ever done that, though? These glasses right here are just my readers from the, from the Dollar Tree. And I don't have to wear them all the time, except for when I'm doing close-up. Like, I can see the comments pretty well. It, I probably ought to wear them when I'm reading those comments so I don't have to straighten my eyes. But as far as, like, sitting here painting, I can see it. So... You've done that before. Oh, I've never done that before. I've gotten a contact stuck in my eye before, like in a, like way up in the top of my eye, like off my eyeball up in the top part of my eye. And boy, that hurts. I can tell you that hurts. We're going to paint. I did one of these. We're going to do something um, similar to what I did three years ago. I was going to post a picture of it, but then I thought, no, I'm just going to redo it. Nobody knows I did it because I wasn't doing them live. And I was going to write on this with some carbon paper, but I forgot my doggone, I, my printout. I have to print out first because with the carbon paper, you're copying something. So you want to have some words printed out or your print of whatever you're doing. And I didn't leave myself enough time. I told y'all I was going live, and I got ahead of myself. So I do that often. My iPad's not wanting to stay on. What y'all been doing today? Tell me, tell me, tell me what you're doing today. Do we have any new people on here? I, the comments aren't working. I don't know if y'all are just being quiet or if they, they quit working. I don't know. I don't know if I've done something. I'm sure somebody's going to tell me on Facebook that I didn't set it to public. And I did. It just keeps setting itself back to private until I'm done, and then I have to go and edit everything. And I don't know why it's doing that. It's strange. But I'm sure it's something on the computer setting, and I probably just need to go fix that. So I need to just get on the computer and do, do some computer work. I need to do that anyway. So we'll see. We'll see if it gets done today or not. I need to, though. I need to. Okay, got it down there. Hey, Miss Kathy. First time watching me on YouTube. Well, I'm glad you're here watching. I've got a couple of videos on here, not very many, five maybe, something like that. Um, my daughter is at the doctor right now having baby check. And so if she texts me and says like, mom, they're admitting me or something like that because she's having contractions, then I'm probably gonna have to jump off here. But hopefully that won't be the case. You need a spring you read from your for your door, but you haven't decided. But, oh, you decided to come watch me instead. Craft along with me, Miss Lois. Craft along with me. I am fixing to start a subscription group over on Facebook. Um, it's going to be just to my subscribers. On my subscribers page, I think it's $9.99 a month. And we're going to meet in there once a week. 
and I'll give you a list of things. We're just gonna do some easy Dollar Tree crafts in there. Nothing fancy, nothing special. I'm not really good at teaching new techniques because I'm usually learning them myself. So, um, I mean, I'll teach it as I, as I learn, but y'all probably wind up teaching me more than, more than that, more than what I teach y'all. So, we're gonna start that. Probably not until June though, because with my daughter fixing to have a baby and I'm going to Ohio, I don't want to start it and then have to miss. So, especially since it's a paid thing. So, in order to see, well, you have to, I know those comments. I have mine, oh, that's why it's hiding. I have mine turned sideways. I have, like, sideways. So that way it doesn't, um, it, um, the comments are over to the side. I don't, when I do on my phone, watch like when I watch Tracy and she's live, I have to swipe the comments off too because I can't see. I can't see the craft. It's real far away. And I've got me, I'm behind on mine. I guess I paused myself. There, maybe now I'm caught up. And there's a lag on my iPad compared to what's on my phone. So that's, that's different too. Like I said, I'm learning all the ins and outs and I tell y'all that every time and y'all are probably sick of hearing it. So I'll be quiet. I won't say it no more. Probably will. I <laughs> probably will. Who am I kidding? Okay, hang on. Got some more spots on here that aren't covered very well, so I'm just going to use some more paint. Do another little double take. I don't care if it's perfect because I'm going to add another color to it, but we're going to stripe it. I got my painter's tape, so we're going to use it. And we're going to we're not going to buffalo check it. We're just going to stripe it. Go make some little nautical stripes. Going to use some navy on it. I figured navy would be pretty. Not worried about what this side looks like. We'll cover it. But I am trying to get the tops halfway decent. I forgot my metal ribbon. I don't know if I have it over here or not. Yes, I do. I have some. Woohoo! Woohoo! Hey, Jennifer! Yeah, if you hold it horizontal. That's how I have my iPad. I have it horizontal so I can see comments. But like I said, when I watch Tracy on my phone, and when I turn my phone horizontal, it doesn't work. It, it's weird. I was on YouTube last night watching a lady. Um, can't remember. I know her name's Lisa, but I don't remember her page name. And she had a two hour long video and I stayed up and watched the whole thing. I should have gone to bed, but I didn't. I stayed awake way too long. Way, way, way too long. But that's all right. That is, I'm tired today, but that's my own fault. That is my own fault. One of these days I'll learn. Let me grab my, y'all, I got painter's tape. Got me a new, I got some new refills. I got a staple gun. And that's it, staples. Staples and a staple gun. That's all I got. Nothing fun. Got some new wood to do our projects. And then I got a new kind of wood that I'm gonna try to cut words with. And if you don't want to paint it, you don't have to because it's a really pretty slate color. Um, but if you want to paint it, you can. But I got to figure out how to do the words first. So, so Bailey might not have to be induced if she. Well, I hope she's not having contractions, Lois, because that puts her another two weeks early. That puts her. She's only at 34 weeks right now, almost 35. And so I, I pray that she's not going into labor by herself. It's too early. Way too early for that. So we're, we're fingers crossed praying, we're praying more than we're fingers crossing that she doesn't go into labor. Okay, I think I'm gonna go up and down. Hey, Nancy. I think I'm gonna go up and down with my stripes. I was gonna go sideways, but everything I do is always sideways, and I know I'm not a very straight person, but I'm gonna try it. Plus, this mason jar is not very straight. So I know this part's not fun to watch either, but it's gotta, you gotta do it. You gotta do it to get to the fun, right? 
I always tape my, my project down. And then I'm just going to take a little piece as my guide to know how far apart I want my stripes. So they're going to be about, a, I think this is inch wide. I think this is inch wide. I really don't care to paint all the way up here. And it's probably not going to be perfect. And I am okay with that. If you are a perfect person, get you out your little um, ruler thing. What's that called? That L-shaped thing. I've got one. I can't think of what it's called. Hello. Is that Michelle? Headed to the orthopedic doctor for your knee. This is Irene. Okay, Miss Irene. Hope you get good news, sister. I just took your order to the mailbox. If that's my my right Irene. You know I can't remember nothing, sister. I feel like I'm wasting this tape after I paid eight dollars for it. <laughs> oh, y'all. And that broke my heart. I walked up to Terry because he was waiting on the saw because they had to cut our wood for us in half. He wanted it cut in half. He didn't want it cut like they cut it last time because we wasted a lot of wood. And so he had them cut it differently this time and we had to wait for the saw guy at Lowe's to get over there. And I went milling around and thankfully I remember that I needed this. Oh, shoot. So um, I walked back and I was like, when did painter's tape get to be eight dollars of course it's the scotch brand i probably could have went to dollar tree and got the off brand and it would have been a whole lot cheaper but <laughs> right irene okay good sister i should have known i mean i did know but i forget you know my brain don't work half the time my squirrely brain I didn't go up all the way here and i'm okay with that um i, I probably should have i may move it I may move it just so I don't have to worry about trying to figure it myself. This is so cockeyed. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna move this one up just a tad. Gonna move it on up. And I'm still going to use my side as a guide, so it'll still be the same distance. I just want to go up further on this jar. Because pretty much that edge is, but we're going to put stuff over that, so it's not going to matter. Not going to matter. Take this off. And get our, we're going to use Dixie Bell. It's chalk mineral, but it's in the navy, so it's going to be a navy paint. A navy paint, y'all. Thank you for sharing and thank you for um, hearting this video. I have to get 4,000 hours over here. And I think I have 200. I'm a wee bit behind. But that's okay. In God's timing, we'll get there. Y'all, this has sat and sat and sat. So I'm hoping it shouldn't go bad. It's never been opened. But my luck. My luck lately. Y'all, this shirt, y'all see this shirt? I got this one from the fairy season thing, but I believe Tracy with Scrappy's Rustics has it in her shop. This is not a really a me shirt because I'm a hugger. I love hugs. I love to give hugs. I love to receive hugs. I'm all about the hugs. Are y'all huggers or not? How many friends do we have on here? How many siblings are on here? 25 of y'all. Yay, y'all. I like it. I like it. Okay, and it darkened up just what we wanted. I was worried that it was just going to be icky. Icky, icky, but it's not. It's pretty. So, see that navy? It almost looks black. It's so dark. Um, buy me a brush. I don't... Bye, Irene. You love hugs too, Lois? I do. I love a hug. I'm a hugger. I hug, I hug Terry probably, I don't know, 50 times a day. I'm sure he probably gets tired of me hugging him. But I just do. I just walk up to him and just hug him. I was hugging him in Lowe's waiting on the saw guy. 
He was probably thinking, get off me, woman. You're a hugger too, Lisa. I am. I'm a big hugger. That's like when I went to church with Cindy, one of the um, one of the people there, one of the gentlemen, he was like, I'm sorry, I'm a hugger. I was like, that's okay, I'm a hugger too. I'm kind of getting, oh, did I get that in the white? I hope not. I did a little bit, but that's okay. Not enough to worry. Not enough to worry. You're a hugger, Patsy. I love hugs. They just make you feel all warm and fuzzy inside. And I'm a happy-go-lucky most of the time, y'all. It takes a lot to really make me upset. I mean, I'll get upset. Obviously, we're human. We're all going to get upset at some point. But it really takes quite a bit. Now, I get my feelings hurt easy. And there's a difference in being upset with somebody and having your feelings hurt. And I'm telling you, I get my feelings hurt real easy. You're a hugger too, Nancy. I just, I am, I get my feelings hurt. <laughs> Always have. I've always worn my feelings on the sleeve. So if people are joking around with me, I have to really know that they're joking because if not, I'm probably going to go cry in the bathroom. I won't let them see me cry. But I'm probably going to go cry in the bathroom if my feelings get hurt. It's just who I am. Who I am. I'm going to put a second coat of this blue navy on here. It covered really well. But I just want to make sure sometimes when you have dark colors, once they dry, you'll start to see the white come through a little bit. So I just want to make sure that I don't have any of that. And I think I've already probably changed my mind as to what I'm going to do on here. Because, well, because that's me. Because that's what I do. I change my mind a lot. A lot, a lot. My oldest daughter is like that, too. She, she wears her feelings on her sleeve, Patsy. I have one daughter who, my oldest daughter, Bailey, she gets her feelings hurt, but when she gets her feelings hurt, she gets mad, and you're going to know it. You're going to know you hurt her feelings. Tori, it depends on who it is. It's going to depend on who it is. And Riley is more like me. She's not really going to tell you. She's probably going to cry somewhere or she's going to cry right there in front of you. So you're kind of going to know. But she won't. Um... Patty, that's the way I am. I'm the same way. Girl, please. It takes so much to make me mad. So much. You don't hurt my family. You don't hurt my friends. And you don't hurt my kids. And I'm probably never going to get mad at you. I do forgive easily because the forgiveness is for you, not for the other person. Doesn't mean that you have to associate with them, though. I do change my mind a lot, Lois. I do. And when I'm crafting, that is when I do my best crafting. Usually, you know, when I, y'all know, you know, if you follow me on Facebook, and I think probably all of y'all have, um, I do my best work when I'm just winging it. Winging it is the best crafting for me. I was looking back on my page today and I saw three years ago is when I started my page in 2019. Um, but just for my chalk couture, it was never going to be anything more. And I was looking back on some of the things that I created and I'm like, boy, I've gotten a lot better since then. Thank goodness. <laughs> some of the stuff was cute. Like the door hanger that I did was super cute. It sold within minutes of me making it. But I've always loved door hangers. Door hangers are just kind of my thing. Door hangers and like tear tray signs and signs to hang on your wall. Are my, I, that's what I like to do. I don't like to get crafty in the way that other people, I, I don't know I guess everybody probably makes signs and stuff, but they they get like, re. I love to redo furniture, but I don't like buying things like my rabbit. I was going to redo this rabbit that's still sitting here, um, and I haven't done it just because it's not my niche. Right, Patty? That's what you have to do. Thank you, Denise. You're a sweet sister. Thank you. I just try to be to people the way I want them to be to me. And it doesn't always work that way. Obviously, it's life and, you know, we're all different. But, um, oh, I hope I don't get bleeding. I, got, I hope I don't got bleeding. 
let me just teach y'all how to speak proper English today. Goodness. I wished I would have printed out my words. That would have been so much more better. Been nice if I'd have brought my drink in here too. I'm always forgetting my drink. Always forgetting my drink. Now I gotta dry this up real good before I pull this tape off. And I'm hoping it didn't bleed through. I hope I got the paint, the tape down. I gotta scooch this back because it's bubbling in some areas. Sometimes when, when you're doing drying chalk paint, if you get it too hot, it'll bubble. Y'all probably already know this, but just in case, never know who's gonna see it that may not know that. So, go get it, we don't care. I don't even know what I, I think I left it in the kitchen. They have a new, okay, so at the restaurant that Terry and I went to, they didn't have Sprite and they didn't have Sierra Mist. They have a new drink called Starry. Do y'all have that where you're from? Starry. If you drink Sprite, then it's it's a knockoff Sprite, kind of like the Sierra Mist, I guess. I don't know. Sprite's always been around to me. Sierra Mist is kind of new to me. But, I mean, not new, new, but you know what I mean. So now they got Starry. And it tastes like Sprite. No, not where you're at, Denise. This is the first day I've heard of it. Um, Blue, Lois says, nope. Well, they have it at the restaurant we went to. You have Starry Pop at your grocery store. Well, this is the first time I've ever drank it. It tastes like Sprite or Sierra Mist, but boy, howdy, is it sweet. It is so much sweeter than, see, I got some bleeding there, but I don't care about that because that's going to be covered up. So as long as it's not on my jar like that, I don't care. And we can always fix it, but I prefer it not be, see, it bled up at the top. I didn't have it down good, but we got good lines so far. So far, we got good lines. And I stuck my finger right in that and it was still wet sheila gray bless it it's okay we'll hide it with a bow or something never know i just don't want to get hold it up here because this is all gonna be covered up up there we got a couple of spots where we'll probably have to touch up but i'm not too worried about it because we're gonna paint over that too I don't know if it's a Pepsi or a Coke product. Hey, Renee. I'm not sure which one it is. They serve Dr. Pepper there, so I don't know. I don't know. And a lot of people don't have Dr. Pepper. They have Mr. Pibb. So there, I've got, like I said, I got a few spots that I need to, ooh, and look how crooked that is. It is crooked, but I don't care. I don't care. I'm I y'all know me. I don't do perfect. So it'd be nice if it was straight, but I did not get those lines straight. I don't know what happened there. It's like the tape got skinny. The tape got skinny on us. It's a Pepsi product. Yeah, it's paint. You can always fix it. You are so right. But we're gonna put this on there and we're gonna this this came off of it. So we're gonna put that back on there. And then we're gonna put probably some metal on it. I don't know yet. I may not do the metal. We'll see. We'll see. And I gotta find, I had my words the other day. I gotta remember what I did with them. I think they're back down here. I gotta let everything fall. Y'all hear stuff, I'm, I'm fine. Still got some wet spots there, so I'm just making sure it's good and dry. Not in here. Not in here. I do want that. Still can't find my words. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. I just changed my mind altogether. I am going to change my mind altogether. I am, I am, I am. Ha! Navy will still look good, I think. So, we're going to use this umbrella. I think. It might be too big. I don't want to put it upside down. I don't want it upside down. I want to paint it this way. I'm going to do it this way. Y'all, we're fixing to go whimsical. Get ready to be whimsy. So we're going to take some... We're going to take this color. 
we are going to use dreams come true. We're going to make this a whimsy thing. I just completely changed my mind. April showers. You got it. And we got May flowers. I'll print, I'll get my words and I'll do my words, but I will, I'll probably wait and maybe I can do that with y'all tomorrow and we'll put that April showers um, and then we'll put bring May flowers on there. But yes, that is exactly what we're going to do. Nancy says it's a Pepsi product. I, I Like I said, it's it's good. It's just very, 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 um, very um, sweet. I was fixing to say sour. It's not sour. It's sweet. I don't know where the umbrella came from. My sweet friend Catherine sent it to me. I'm not sure 100% where she got it. But I know I love it. And this paint that I'm using, this Dreams Come True, is plaster paint. And I have a link for it. It's part of the Sassy Kit. It's on my page. If you go all, you'll have to scroll to April 1st on Facebook. Um, and it's in there. I may have it in my link tree. But I'm not sure. But y'all, this color is beautiful. And against that navy, it is going to pop so good. It is going to pop, pop, pop. I'm not worried about the edges because they are that burnt. You can tell this was cut like on a glow forge, probably. So I'm not gonna worry about that. I I, I know I'm not painting the the stick, the handle, the, the stick, the handle, because we're gonna paint it black. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? I love it. I'm glad I looked over and saw that. See, things always work out. You heard my ring here, crafting kids. That's okay, Miss Judy. Trying to color your rooster for your my roost, my rules. Is that the chalk tour transfer? It's beautiful. I love this color. And our flowers are different, lighter. They're pastel -y, but that's okay. We're just doing whimsical. We're, we went whimsy. We decided to go whimsy. If I would have known I was going to do this, I would have done that a lighter blue. But I didn't know. I changed my mind midstream. And that's okay. That's allowed in crafting. You can do whatever you want to in crafting. It's your craft. Now, if you're making it for somebody, obviously, you got to stick by the rules. But if you're doing it on your own, you do whatever you want. That looked blue. Did it did. I didn't get my brushes good and something. I did something to them. I gotta put this on for this because th this is little. And I wanna make sure I get all of it. Ah! I'm sticking my fingers in this while it's still wet. Like, I don't know how to paint or something today. I don't know what my problem is. Stuff's not drying quickly either. Okay. And y'all know I can't leave it alone, right? Y'all know I can't leave it alone. So y'all probably know what's coming on. Judy, you got me. I'm still so new to YouTube. I think you have to exit out of it, like exit out of that other person. There's a should be an X button and then, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me on it because I'm, I'm new. I'm new. Guess what I'm going to do? Do y'all know? Do y'all know what's going to happen to this? Polka dots, Renee, you got it. Ding, ding, ding. That is correct. That is correct. Correct, correct old. Gonna get my little tool here. My green one's got the biggest polka dot. I may want to use something bigger. We'll see. Nope, I like them little. I can already tell by the first one. I'm not gonna do them super close together. I want them sporadic. Whoops, I got, the, I done dotted that one twice. 
boo booed on that dot. Oh, the chalk couture. I don't think that they'll let you switch. The only way that you can switch, um, are you, Judy, are you a designer or are you just, um, do you just buy it like as a, oh, just as a customer? I know that if you are a designer, you have to get out, you have to wait six months, and then you can switch your upline. But as far as um, if you're a customer, I think you can just call and tell them if whoever you're buying it from isn't being helpful. I mean, you have to obviously, you know, you don't want to tell if they are helpful, then you don't, wouldn't want to say that. But if they are not helpful, then you would want to um, just ask them if you could switch. As a customer, you should be able to just switch. I'm not 100% sure how they do that. You probably have to call. They don't let us. They don't let us get involved a lot. And if you're a designer, you were a designer, you already know that. They don't let us get involved as far as some of the things that they do. And they're very, very strict on their rules, which I get because you do have people who bounce around from person to person. It's kind of like in Mary Kay. You can just go from one Mary Kay person to the next. Um. When you, when, you know, they just want you to be faithful to the person unless there's a problem. Okay. So now we have our little polka dotted umbrella. You can see the one where I got two, two dots close together, but I don't care about that. Imperfections make things cute. So we're going to put that there. And then these, like I said, I don't know where they came from. My sweet Catherine sent me these. They've got holes in them, but I'm not worried about that. There's four of them. And we're going to use all four of them, even though I typically only like to work in odd numbers. But I'll show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to kind of layer these. Well, I may only do three. Try to decide how I want them. I'm gonna put them like that, and then I can probably put that one. I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I love that. That was loud. Sorry, y'all. You just did it as a hobbyist. You may be able to change Miss Judy. Um, when you go to order, I mean, you'll have to, you may have to create a new account though. That's the only thing, but then you're also club couture. I don't know. You're probably just going to have to call sister. I, I wish I could be of more help in that area, but they don't make it easy. They do not make it easy to switch. And I mean, I know that they have a reason for that. Like I said, they want people to be faithful and you get people who, you know, like me want to help everybody. And you just can't. They don't. They don't want it to be that way. Okay, so I'm putting that back one there. Just got ink all over because that wasn't dry again. But that's okay. I'm gonna cover it up. I got to get this thing dry. You're just a customer, and your lady doesn't do lives anymore. Yeah. It, it will let you go up and choose your creator, but if she's already got like club couture and stuff going on, I think if you're just going to buy product, you could just go up and switch your designer, like Miss Denise said. But I know that if you're a club couture, they have to go in and they have to change it. It's, it's all crazy. It's all crazy. Okay. So I'm going to put some of this on here. I'm going to see if these scissors will cut it. I don't know. I've never, I don't even know if I've ever used this stuff. Pretty, pretty good. Pretty dandy. Okay, we're gonna get these out the way. And we've got one more color. I could actually take the pink one off. This ribbon is the one from Hobby Lobby. This is not the one from the Dollar Tree. This one is from Hobby Lobby and it has the little flowers on it. So it's perfect for this project. See that? I got a mess going on, y'all. Hang on. 
I'm fixing to cover all this up. Oh, Miss Judy, you're sweet. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. More than you know. I'm getting some of this out of my way. I got all these nasty brushes. I didn't bring my cup of water back in here. You can't, you can't wrap this very good, so I just keep one of my Dollar Tree clamps on there. Okay, now, now I can get this down. And be careful when you're putting this down because this glue and this metal, you'll, you'll hurt yourself. you burn yourself. My lady, when I first started doing chalk couture, the lady that I was under was one of my friends. Signed up under her, she quit. So her upline, that was became my upline, she quit. So I did chalk couture for three years with no upline, or two years. Two years with no upline. And finally, Donna Wingo, don't know if y'all know who she is, but she's in chalk couture. She finally helped me find my upline, which is Sarah Shrunk. And she's amazing. Um... She, she has helped me more than anybody. And when I was taking her advice, I was doing well in chalk tour. Well, I kind of, I kind of laid low on it. Haven't done as much with it. So it's kind of gone down a little bit, but it's, I'm not a salesperson. I am not a salesperson. If somebody wants to buy from me, great. If they don't, that's okay too. It, it, I'm not, I'm just not, I can never like be a used car salesman by any means. This one here. I don't even think words are needed. I think you get what this is, right? I mean, I know Miss Lois said it right off. I, I, I'm just not. I never, I couldn't sell nothing if I had to. Let's put this blue one on here instead of the pink one, only because we have that pink, and that way we'll have, we'll be all kinds of colorful then. We can still use the pink one, or maybe we'll do this. Maybe we'll do it that way. We'll do it that way. So April showers bring May flowers. Miss Judy said that the other day on one of my lives, and then Miss Lois knew right off the bat what I was doing here. Okay, so now all we got to do is put these down. I think I want to make a bow. I'm not putting glue on every one, but quite a few of them because I want it to stay. And then we don't have as many places to touch up. We need to touch up right there and up here just a little tiny bit. And we got it covered good, y'all. I think this is turning out cute. And like I said, it wasn't at all what I intended. It's not what I was going for when I came on. I completely changed my mind. Mid um, craft. You love the springy. I, this one is very springy, isn't it? It's very springy. Thank you, Lois. I was reading. I was trying to catch up on where I was behind. And I think what I'll do, scooch, scooch, is I'm gonna take that yellow, cause it's got our pink and we've got yellow. And I think I'm gonna take, do I have any of the smaller ones or did I already use them? We'll use that one for the polka dots or we'll use stripes. We'll use stripes. I must've already used my pink that I had cut already. That's too bright. That's too bright. Too much red. But that's okay. What I do with it? I've got pink over here. I got some pink somewhere around here, right here in front of my face. We'll do this. So that way we'll have all the colors ish, kind of close. And we'll make a small bow. These ribbons right here, not this one, 
but this one and this one are on my website if you're interested in any of the colors of these ribbons. I have, there's several on there. I do have it fixed. I haven't got it completely fixed, but I've got it to where you can go look at all the wood products. You can go look at all the napkins and you can go look at all of the, no, the wood products and the ribbon. I don't know if I've done the napkins yet. I think I need to do the napkins and the freshies. I think it's the t-shirts. Yeah, that's what it is. It's the t-shirts the ribbon, and the wood products. I'm working on getting the other ones fixed that way too. So, um, everyone did neutral for Easter. I like color too. Um, oh, thank you, Renee. I, I, I love color. I like neutral though too. It, I guess it depends on kind of what day, what, what day it is. Oh, I hope I didn't freeze. I don't know how freezing works on YouTube. I did a lot of neutral for Easter, I feel like. But I did a lot of color too. Looking, I'm looking down here. I think I just, I mixed it up. I had it, I had it mixed up. You can put in a piece of your happy Easter sign or is it too big of my happy Easter? I'm not sure which happy Easter sign. You mean just the one that says? I'm lost. <laughs> Look, I'm lost. Does that even surprise y'all even a little bit? I'm telling you, the nickel, the nickel thing was so me. Behind you. Oh, this one. I know what you're, okay. I get what you're talking about now. The neutral, the neutral. Okay. <laughs> it takes me a minute, y'all. I'm blonde. It takes me a minute. I should have been the blonde crafter. That's what we should have named my page. Silly me. Okay. I got what you're saying now. It takes me a minute. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and dovetail this again. I did that too yesterday to y'all too. Made y'all sit through dovetailing when I should do it in the beginning. I never know if I want to do it. I'm not going to do the yellow one. Yeah, on the paint rack, the one behind you. <laughs> Get it, Sheila. Figure it out. Oh, okay, y'all. I put two contacts in my eye today. Give me grace. <laughs> no, the other one on the paint rack. Oh, that one up there. That one. That one I did a couple of years ago. I did that one. I didn't do that one this year. I did it last year, I believe. I don't even remember where I got that Happy Easter. I think I got it at the at-home store, but I don't know for sure. Can't remember. Okay, I'm with y'all now. No, Lois, I just, I'm just silly. I just, I don't know. I, I don't know what's going on. Don't know what's going on half the time. Terry tells me I live in La La Land, and I might, but I like it there. I don't mind it there. Okay, I didn't, I did not dovetail the, the yellow, just because I do want those to stick out more. And I'm going to put that on this side, I believe. I'm just going to put a regular old hanger on it, because I don't want to put, um, a beaded hanger. I just don't want to take away from anything. If I did put a beaded hanger on here, it would be a colored beaded hanger. But I just love this, even with the navy on it. At first, I was like, okay, that navy's going to look kind of funny. But it's really cute. Looky there. Looky there. How sweet is that? And then I'm just going to take, this came with it. So I'm just going to take it and I'm going to glue it on here. Try not to get my fingers in it. Another thing that that lady does, that Lisa lady does that I was watching last night, is she uses um, masking tape as her Band-Aid. I know, Denise, I am. I am very silly all the time. Y'all, this is me. This is me. I'm this way all the time. Not just sometimes, all the time. 
unless I don't feel good and then I'm sleeping. You go ahead and take a trip to the Dollar Tree. I want some more of these. I'm going to have to find out where Miss Catherine got this because that is too cute, y'all. And then what I'll do is I'll, I'm out of brown crafting paper, but I could also take, oh, that's hot. Don't let that fall on me. I could also take some of this cork board probably. Let's see. Well, that was not big enough, but I have, I also have some um, felt and I can cut felt around it just to finish it off so you don't see the back of that. I used to not worry about that. But I got to thinking, you know, if I'm going to buy something from somebody, I kind of want it to be finished. So, I think it has to be. You could put a welcome on here. You could put anything you wanted to. But I think I love it the way that it is. So, what do y'all think? Be sure to like and share my video if you don't mind. Um, that just helps me get out there in the YouTube world. This is like starting all over on Facebook for me. And I'm nervous, more nervous over here. I'm trying to be, today was better. Today was better. But um, anyway, you guys have a wonderful day. I will be back on Facebook tonight, but it will not be until eight because I have my mentor group. So I have to do my mentor group at seven. And then as soon as I'm done there, I will be live on Facebook. So I love you guys and have a wonderful day. Thank you, Denise. The stripes, I like the stripes. I mean, like I said, I need to touch it up a couple of spaces, but I'm not too, I'm not too angry with it. It's pretty darn cute. So anyway, have a great day, everybody. Bye.